I love the story of the sisters in this show because it is Mary discovering, yes, that romantic love, but it's the sisters rediscovering their love mm. as well. They've been apart for a couple of years since the end of the novel, and to f see them find their way back to each other in their new lives is really a beautiful journey. I was a Jane Austen fan, and I grew up familiar with the Colin Firth BBC production of Pride and Prejudice, <laughs> and um, really wanted to be Lizzie for a long time. <laughs> In this play, the sisters not only support, guide, and love each other, but also really challenge each other and can see the potential of the best in each other and and hold uh, each other like accountable and to mm. those standards in a really beautiful and generous and loving way. The intelligence of not only the writing but the characters themselves has aged very well and I appreciate that as a woman that we really do get to go on this ride with this very frank and open um, and trustworthy kind of champion, certainly in Lizzie in the in Pride and Prejudice, and um, for our show, we get we really get to see Mary's story and her integrity and these things that we want to continue championing. Um, and there's the romance. I mean, the costumes are beautiful. There is such a a romance to this time. This can be a pretty tough time of year for a lot of people and I think there's something quite special about being able to go to the theatre and watch something that might be a little bit frivolous, a little bit light and escapist, but what you come out of it with is a real sense of joy and a sense of feeling of belonging. Amidst the chaos of Christmas time, just come in, sit down, warm up, take a look at our community and spend some time together.